Hey everybody, it's Riley here, concealedcarry.com, and welcome to this preview of what should be showing up on your doorstep relatively soon. That is, for all of our Guardian Nation members, your quarterly box of gear. Although this quarter it's not going to be in a box, well, well, it may eventually show up in a box, but what you're actually going to receive is going to be for a, well, it's a single thing. However, you might be able to buy multiple things with it. Um, I know that you, some of you are familiar already with the concept of us doing some vouchers, and we do the vouchers when we feel we have to in cases like what you're gonna find here today. We did something similar a few years ago with another company, um, but we're really excited this go around to work with a new company that I'm excited about uh, because they've actually been doing some business with another uh, kind of business partner, not business partner, but Grey Guns is a sponsor of mine. And Grey Guns actually recommended these guys to us and thought we'd be a good fit to include some of their products in an upcoming box. And so we were able to make that all come together and super excited about that because what this is, I know I got a label here kind of covering some of that. This is literally how this showed up from uh, the USPS, how it showed up in my box uh, from the company. And that is Angry Bear Arms is what they are known as. And they make sights and they've got a bunch of different sights. Uh, they've got plain sights, fiber optic sights, night sights of different varieties and types different sites of different heights for optics ready guns and non optics ready and they've got a pretty good you know coverage as far as making sites for a lot of the popular common brands of guns that, that you're probably carrying or using and so probably not quite everything but we feel like pretty much all of you should be able to at least find something on their site that will be useful to you if you're looking to make an upgrade on your sites now more and more people are adding optics to their guns and a lot of times what that means is ending up having to change up your sights as well because you put on an optic and you want to still have some backup iron sights, which I definitely recommend, especially if it's a defensive oriented gun. You definitely want a secondary backup form of sights on your gun if you're running a red dot. So Angry Bear Arms is coming through, I think, big time clutch for you guys, for our Guardian Nation members, because... What you're going to receive is a $120 voucher from Angry Bear Arms. And you, th you, you might go, okay, $120 voucher. I mean, great, awesome. That's, that's fantastic. What does that get me? Does it get me a single set of sights? Does it get me, uh, you know, like some sites I've seen out there on the market can cost as much as $150, $160, $170. And is the $120 going to, you know, get you there, get you all the way as far as being able to buy even a set of sights? The good news is, is Angry Bear Arms is a, really a phenomenal company. We enjoyed getting to know them a little bit on the phone and discussing things with them. They actually make sites for other site companies and gun companies that you know. You just don't know that these guys are making those sites. So in other words, they do a lot of OEM manufacturing for other companies. What that means for you is that when you buy direct from them, you end up actually saving money. So the cool thing is, and this is what we're excited about with the Angry Bear Arms $120 voucher code that will be right there on the, when you get your card, it'll look just like this, except it'll have a code right there in that space. What that means is you can actually, in many cases, probably buy two sets of sites with this one voucher. And that's super exciting. And that's exactly what I did here as a, as a test and to demonstrate and kind of show you guys what you're actually going to get when you place an order through a Angry Bear Arms is this is the package that I received. I ordered two sets of sights. So what do we have in here? I ordered a set of optics ready HK VP9 sights and these are the fiber optic ones. So it's a in this case, it's a actually it's a blackout, blacked out rear sight and a fiber optic front sight, and it's optics ready. So I'll be able to mount those on a VP9 and also put an optic on it and have backup irons through the optic window. So that was the first thing I got was the fiber optic uh, set of sights. And why did I do that? Well, because I thought it would be a good variety because I also knew I was going to order some of their night sights, and that's what this set here is. Is and I think this is actually blacked out rear as well. I'm actually partial to that, just so you know. I don't do much in the way of dots or anything on my rear sights anymore. So personal preference is what I like to see visually. So this is a blacked out rear sight, but this is a kind of a, a yellow green uh, fluorescent colored front sight 
with tritium di uh, vial in the center. So this is a night site, but also has a nice high contrast, bright yellow green um, dot around that, that tritium as well. So, and this is also optics ready. And this is designed for a SIG P320. And you guys know I used to shoot a lot of 320s and you know still have a lot of 320s, even though I'm shooting HKs more now. Uh, but I wanted to go ahead and order a set just to, just to see how the P320 sights compared and the VP9 sights and fiber optic and, and night sight uh, tritium. And so there you go. This, all this right here, this was ordered with a single voucher. Okay, so you, when you go to angrybearearms.com to claim and redeem your voucher, this is, this is just straight up cash, guys. So whatever your total is, you can make that up whatever you want it to be. You can add as many products as you want. At the end of the day, including shipping, like in this case, I think, you know, there was, I think, the, I think I actually did pay a little bit because with this particular combination, I think I ended up at like $124 or something like that. And uh, so it just subtracted the $120 out of that. I paid like four or five bucks and there you go. I got these two sets of sights. So Lots of options, SIG, HK, Canix, Taurus, I saw they had some options for, uh, Springfield, Glock, obviously. Um, I know I'm missing a bunch. Smith & Wesson, I'm pretty sure, is on there. So uh, pretty much all the big common brand name firearms manufacturers, I, I believe you'll, there's a good chance you'll be able to find something that works for you and you'll be able to make a site upgrade on your gun today. A couple of things there though. Uh, definitely if you're not comfortable installing your own sights or removing sights yourself, uh, and it actually says here on the packaging, a certified gunsmith is recommended for installation of this product. It's not required, it is recommended however. Um, there are sight pusher tools you can get. Uh, you can buy some right on Amazon that work pretty well. I've got a, I've got a sight push, pusher tool, it works pretty good. Um, you can you know, just use a sight pusher. You can probably even hammer your sights out if, you, if you're not super partial on, you know, how the end result ends up being. Uh, or find, you know, if you're just not comfortable with doing any of that yourself, you might just go down to your local gun shop that has a gunsmith and, and have them put them on for you um, if you'd like to do that. But uh, yeah, we're actually, I'm gonna actually, I'm gonna mount the VP9 ones here today. And uh, I don't have everything ready to go right now, but We'll, you'll see a little bit of, of B-roll of, of the sights installed and seeing how, how they look on, on the gun. And Actually, I'll give you a before and an after. How about that? I'll show, give you some B-roll of what the sights were like on the gun as it came, and then we'll put these upgraded sights on. I'm really excited. I like fiber optic sights, especially for general purpose shooting, especially, and especially for competition shooting. So that fiber optic just works so well you know, as far as you know, it just gives you a really nice, bright, crisp, uh, high contrast dot, and and that's that's really what I'm looking for in a good set of sights. So I want to want to be able to see the front sight when I want to see it, and I want to see that it's high contrast as it compares to everything else, both the target and the rear sight and everything. So I'm really excited to check those out. I do already have a set of these Angry Bear Arm sights on a P365 of mine. Uh, that uh, that's actually the first time I got familiar with them, and. It's a great product, so super excited to be able to share that now with all of you via this voucher. And we do it as a voucher because, well, we could have just sent you all Glock sites, but half of you probably don't have Glocks, right? So, so you'll get this uh, as of now, as you're watching this video, that means these have already shipped out. These two cards are gonna come in an envelope. Watch for those to show up. And you get that envelope, open it up, you're gonna see this right here, and right away you can go and claim your voucher on angrybearearms.com. You'll you will note that this voucher is only valid till May 31st of this year, so you don't want to delay too long to get it done. You don't have to do it right away. You got you know several months, but just don't uh, fall asleep at the wheel there and, and find out on June 1st you missed your opportunity to claim your voucher. So there you go. I'm gonna go ahead and mess around with these ones here and stick them on a VP9, and we'll see what the end result looks like. So these fiber optic Angry Bear Arms um, sights come with the two colors. These are the two primary colors of uh, fiber optic sights. I think actually, you know, you can probably get like orange and things like that too, but from other suppliers, but uh, this is gonna come with a red one and a green one. Um, I am actually quite partial to the green fiber optic uh, it's what I've used in all my fiber optic pistols for a number of years now. So we're, we're gonna walk you through 
how to install properly fiber optic into a site. Um, it's not difficult, but there's just a couple things you, you want to know. So um, what we're going to do actually to start is we're actually going to start with this. Uh, we're going to make sure it fits, first of all. Okay, yep, that looks great. Okay, and we're going to use a lighter, or in this case, I'm just going to use this little butane torch. You do not want to touch the flame to the fiber optic itself, and you don't need to get it that hot. But what we're, going to, what we're going to do is we're going to expose the end of this fiber optic to a little bit of heat, okay, and you'll see it'll kind of mushroom out a little bit is what you're going to see, all right, and that's what we're looking for. So we're, when we get that mushrooming, actually, let me get this, I'm going to get this turned around um, this direction. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to expose that to some heat, get it to mushroom, and once it mushrooms, we're going to pull it into, so we'll have it about like here, and when we see the end of this mushroom out, we're going to pull it inside until it basically stops itself. What that's going to do is it's going to mushroom out, but when we pull it through, it's going to fill that whole cavity on the back side of the front sight, which is what we want. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and do that now. So just get it exposed to the heat here. Not gonna see it starts to mushroom. Okay, and we're gonna just pull it in and set it in place there and let it cool. And we will see actually, oh, no, yeah, no, that's pretty good. It doesn't feel like it's gonna come out. That's what we want. So we can see now that it is the same size, we basically, by mushrooming it and then pulling it into the site, it conforms it to the exact shape and size as that hole in the site. You see that, and that's what we want, because we want to see a nice clean circle that's fiber optic, it's all lit up. Okay, now what works best for this next step is actually like a pair of uh, nail clippers, um, but we're gonna use this, and I can't quite get in there super close, so we're gonna make note of where I wanna cut this at. And you wanna trim this next bit just a little, like maybe not even quite an eighth of an inch, more, more like a, maybe like a strong sixteenth of an inch past the front of the site, okay? So I'm gonna um, hopefully gauge this correctly. All right. We'll just take another look at it here. Okay, so we're going to trim it right about there, I think. Ooh. Okay, let's see how we did. Yeah, not bad. Okay, so now what we're gonna do is we're gonna make sure this is all the way forward, okay? And same sort of thing, we're just going to heat it up, and this time it's gonna kind of mushroom, and we're gonna let it keep going back and back. Oop, get, oop, get a little bit too hot. And at this point I can actually kind of mush it in there. This is on the front side of the site. This is not my cleanest one I've done, but that's not the end of the world, okay? So you're not even gonna see that from your site picture, okay? The fact that that's kinda ugly, but there you go. That's the idea of installing fiber optic. And when we're all said and done, we don't want there to be, oh, there is a little bit of play. So I may end up redoing this, but that's the idea. If, ideally, you don't want any play here because then each time the gun cycles, that's gonna be doing a little bit of this too. And over time, that'll kind of you know break the fiber optic a little bit. But uh, you get the idea. So if I was to be a little more careful next time, I'd bring my, my nail clippers in. I'd trim it a little bit tighter, a little bit closer. We don't have to get it quite so hot and you know get it so melted like that. Um, so there you go. All right, guys. So you saw it. You saw the product that's coming to you for this quarter's box. You see now a set of these sites installed. Super excited about that. Looking forward to running this VP9 with these new fiber optic sites. Later on, I'll get the P321s installed on one of my P320s. But uh, there you go. Really nice quality site made from steel, made in the USA. I don't think I mentioned that earlier in the video. Uh, actually, in the state of Missouri, if I'm not mistaken. So awesome product, awesome folks over there. Please give them your support. We're glad we could partner up with them to bring you this voucher for this quarter's box. Really hope you enjoy it and that you enjoy shooting your new Angry Bear Arms sights. Thanks for being members of Guardian Nation, guys.